Hey. Ooh, magic surprise party is nearly upon us. Party is prepped and everyone did their part and I'm not even stressing about it. <laughs> that Parker guy is chatty, but he worked fast and made the time fly. Great. That is good to hear. Oh, it's nearly time. Head to the party, wait with the others. I'll bring magic, you yell surprise when we walk in and then the party is on. Okay, okay. I will head there now. Oh boy. Surprise! Uh, surprise? Even Cap's here. Oh my, what a surprise. Happy birthday? I had no idea. <laughs> Optional, mingle at the party. I Hell yeah, we will mingle. Party in years. What a delightful distraction. Though I find my work at the forge invigorating, the occasional entertainment that is a, events burning out. <laughs> that is a huge glass the dock is holding. Can. Oh, I meant literal burning from the inside out. One of the hazards of manipulating Hellfire. You're popping. Ooh. You you like it, don't you, caretaker? Came together nicely. Are you surprised? Somewhat. Nico's plans get ahead of her at times. But this is... it's quite pleasant. It is what it is. Hello, Steve. Did you get her anything? A uh, gift card? Uh, Tony! What do you get, the Queen of Limbo? From everything I'd heard about the Abbey, I hadn't expected it to be so festive. You've been here for like two minutes. What did you hear? Just the basics from Tony and Carol. They made it sound like a wayward home for troubled youths. Do you believe that? So far, I see heroes throwing a birthday party for one of their teammates. It's what the Avengers used to do before we got so busy. Treasure these moments. They'll keep you going when times are tough. Thanks, Steve. I prefer smaller parties. My last birthday had 2,000 guests. Why would you need How that many? I know thousands of people. I wouldn't say I know them. Most of them are business flunkies, glad handers, general hangers on. Half the night I'm shaking hands and managing expectations. I spend so much time as Mr. Stark, I'm lucky if I get to be Tony. Sounds lonely, Tony. Birthdays are better with people who know you. I'm coming around to it. Oh, yeah. I plan to invent a worldwide crisis next year to have a cozy birthday party. Although. No. No, I shouldn't. Hello, hello Carol. Been a while since we've been able to let loose. No. The Avengers, you mean? Everyone. Yeah, we've been busy. We see far too much of each other. Carol, you're and yet partially at fault with this. I can't stop thinking about Bruce. I want to hate him for what he did, but I keep wondering if this was our fault. He always gets into trouble when he's alone. Did we blow him off? Did he reach out, but we missed it? I don't know. Uh, we can always do better for our friends. Yes, that might be what happened. Do not let it happen with the others. Yeah, I'm not always the best with interpersonal stuff. That is Doesn't a... mean I can't get better at it. Uh, what is on her plate? <sighs> Enough of my moping. It's I'm just like to enjoy this party. Just some crackers and some cheese same. and some bread. Hello, magic. It's too much. What? What is wrong? You said this party would be small. It is small. That is what Nico told me. This seems more elaborate than what she described. Then you are blameless. Hunter. This is worse than I expected. Come on. But I shall withstand it. I wish to be alone. But uh, this is your, this your party? Hello, boys. This is great. I wish the other heroes did stuff like this. Celebrate birthdays? Yeah. I guess it's difficult when you don't know each other's real names or actual birthdays, which would completely invalidate our secret identities. But I mean, why are we talking about this when there's cake to cut? That is a. I just realized how huge that cake is. Carol, what, do you have more to say? We're go for cake, right? Soon. And save some for the rest of us. No promises. Are you gonna cut the cake without us? This party was a great idea. Maybe it'll cheer up the Avengers. You think so? Hopefully. It's a party, right? 
I hope it helps him feel at home. Late? You know what they call this? The calm before the storm. What makes you say that? Just a feeling. I will cut the cake. I, I, I will not cut the cake. Nico, we will cut the Just cake. Just me or is Magic not having a good time? I heard Magic does not like surprises. No, that can't be it. We're friends. I'd know if that was true, right? Oh, Nico. I don't get it. Everyone loves surprise birthday parties. I should know. I missed out on a few when I was on the run. Why are you so concerned? Wanda is gone. Bruce Banner is fighting for the other team, and the world's going to actual hell if we don't stop it. A birthday party is a good way to lift everyone's spirits. I'm sure we can fix this. You mind letting her know it's time to cut the cake? Sure. Okay. Yes. I'll be right there. Let's cut the cake magic, but without your giant sword. What? Where? Where? I heard you. Burning skies, air combat, World War II, Carol like this. I fucking heard you, cat. You're lucky I decided to look away this time. What? Kate Cutting. Are you alright? No, this is too much. It is all Nico's fault. It is not. And here she comes to fish for praise. Come on. I have endured enough of this. This has gone on long enough. You made me the center of attention I do not need at a party I did not want. So what do you want now? To cut the cake? Magic, wait. Fine. I will cut the cake. Magic. No. Well. Well. Happy birthday. Nice, Tony. Always wanted to do that. Do what? Smash a birthday cake so hard it explodes. Why would you want to do that? I have complicated feelings about my birthday. So why haven't you? It's... Smash a cake someone made for me? I was gonna say, it's, it's just rude. rude. You could bake your own cake. Doesn't have the same appeal. Carol. Steve. For your next birthday, I'm baking you a cake. Oh yeah. You go on. You have my blessing to smash it into space. But then we're down a birthday cake. I'll make two. I'll bake there you go. Second one's for eating. And that's why you're Captain America. Captain America. Can't wait to see the look on Tony's face. It's right behind you. Or the icing, if I can aim it right. Uh, anyway. Liliana's my friend. How could I have missed this? Look, it's, uh, blaming yourself helps no one. What matters is that you make things right. Let's go. You're right, but how am I supposed to do that? I want to fix this, but I, I can't follow her to limbo. Although... Although what? Maybe you could? I could what? Uh, fine, let me know Tell how. Tell me what I need to do. The staff of one can bring you close to her. When you find her, could you talk to her? Make sure she's all right? That's all I care about. Fine. What can I expect from Limbo? How different will this be from our usual trips through Limbo? I know as much as you do. The landscapes might be trippier than usual. Well, and how do I get back? Is this a one-way trip? It shouldn't be. Once you find magic, she can open a portal to send you back. Hopefully, both of you. Fine. Any advice? What is the best way to approach magic? I feel like I'm the last person you should ask. I'm sure the others have some advice. No, I'm asking you. Fine. I need a moment. I want to see what the others have to say. Can't hurt to ask. Tell me when you're ready and I'll send you to Limbo. Sure. Sure thing, Nico. 
Hey, Spider-Man. Was it me? Did I mess up? I messed up, didn't I? No, it wasn't you. You did nothing wrong. Really? Really. Good, good. Well, I don't know her at all, but she seems really cool. And it's still a party until I hear otherwise. If you think it'll help, tell her I'll stick around. Aha, stick around, because he's Spider-Man. Wish I'd picked up on Magic's mood before she unloaded on Nico. Sometimes I can tell when she's getting upset. Talk her down, you know? Do you have any advice? Just be there for her. That goes a long way with magic. I will. Hey, Blade. That went exactly the way I expected. Oh, okay, really, I Blade? To speak with magic. I told you so now. Any advice? Okay. Woman's not hard to figure out if you pay attention. No, she's not. She does not say much. Makes it easier to listen. Oh, this guy knows exactly what to say. Are you really going to chase the birthday girl through a hellish dimension she completely controls? Yes. Yes, I am. She's my friend. I cannot do nothing. If there is a chance, I will bring her back. Oh, I'm not saying you shouldn't. I'm documenting the weirdest birthday party I've ever attended. Hey, if you take too long, I call dibs on your cake. There's... If we can scavenge some off the ceiling. There, there is no cake left, Tony. There's no cake left. I was afraid this would happen. I will bring her back. No, do not hit me. I, I told you so. When you find her, make sure she knows the Abbey will always be a home to her. Sure. Hey, Carol. I'm guessing this is out of character for magic? Yes, I think so. Hmm. Well, good luck bringing her back. Any advice? Don't smash the cake A into the ceiling. A friend of mine gets overwhelmed like that. Tough love doesn't work. Neither does unwanted advice. Basically, don't do what I always do. That'll just make it worse. What do you always do then? Steve, you seem like a reasonable okay. person. Is there anything I can do to help? I could use some advice. My gut says this isn't a clash of personalities. Magic's fighting her own demons. Nico happened to catch some friendly fire. Thanks. I will keep that in mind. I'll leave you to it. Good luck, Hunter. Oh boy, oh boy. Strange, you seem very small next to Captain America. To limbo, then. I caution you. This shall not resemble the leisurely jaunts you take from the wild cliffs. Any pointers? If you find yourself upon a path, do not stray from it. Especially if someone or something encourages you to do so. Cool. Oh, and, it's terrible. Uh, bring some hand sanitizer. Few realize our reality is the least, let's say, sticky. Okay. Well, all right, send me. Thanks for doing this. Any questions, or are you ready to go? Send me. All right. Send me after magic. Okay. Here goes nothing. Into this, into this elaborate cutscene. Where's the staff? When blood is shed, let the staff of one emerge. Well. Thanks for doing this. No, just walk through the portal, right? Everyone's here? Good. Alright. Oh, boy. Hell yes, skill lessons. Who are you? Oh, boy. You made a wish. And I'm in the business of granting wishes. Tell me, why does your heart ache? They forgot. Today is my... my... Oh, sweetly. Your birthday. What oh, a wonderful her... way to learn what your family truly thinks of. Her birthday's a sore subject, that's why. They don't love me. Nobody does. We do, Magic. We do. I can bring you to a magical kingdom. Make you its queen, loved by all in its domain. Who is, is it? have to wish it so. Is this a Shadow King? I could never be as special as a queen. Now, now. That's a lie your family will tell you. I ought to know you're a very special girl. Before we go, I have a question. Is it, it, it... Of course. 
Ask okay. me anything, my queen. Are... are you a monster? Oh, child. I'm so much more than that. I'm a friend. The only one you'll ever need. I know Strange told me not to stray from any past, but... This looks amazing. That's a good-looking skybox. Well, that just popped in. That didn't look too good. It's um, it's the Shadow King. It's Aubrey Plaza. Pick all these up. Ah, oh, damn it, there's so many. Oh. I thought that was a weird dead lizard. No, it's a branch. Just a branch. Magic. Ah, oh, excuse me. Magic, where are you? It's nowhere. It's freaking nowhere. I think we're about to. Oh. Devil May Cry 5. A house in limbo. What is this place? It's, uh. It's Dante Virgil's home from DMC5. It'll be on fire soon. Full eye golden. Wait, what? Oh. Wow, that looks fucking awful. <laughs> okay. So what's full eye golden ability? It's not an ability. It might be a hunter customization, but it's not here. What a, there's no customization. Oh well. All right, I'm going to the house. Hunter, what are you doing here? Here to steal your shit. Come on. It is not possible to enter limbo without my knowing. How did you get here? Nico used the staff of one. Of course. And why did she not come herself? Uh. She feels terrible for embarrassing you. She thought it would make things worse. Well, that makes two of us. Wait, if you found your way to this place, what did you hear? Everything. Uh, secret safe with me. Or... No, she's a straight shooter though. She, she needs to know. Well, I think I know why you hate your birthday. My deepest shame. You are the first beyond myself to know this. The first person, at least. The creature you heard brought me here. But my childish needs cursed me to this terrible place. I lost my childhood to one bad choice. I trusted a silver tongue instead of my own family. Um, uh, tell me what happened. I want to know who did this to you. I did this to myself. The creature held no power over me until I allowed it. This day is an anniversary of my weakness. Nothing more. That's why she hates your, uh, her, that's why she hates her birthday. Um, 
I can't. Don't tell her what to do, but tell her what you think about her. Who you were does not matter. It is who you become that counts. I would dismiss such words from anyone else. But you, of all people, would know this to be true. Hell yeah. I should stay here this evening. I can endure the stares and whispers, but not tonight. Uh. I don't need to go. I can stay here with you. You could hang out here if you want. I... I would like that. Cool. Let's hang out here, Magic. And, uh... We don't have to leave. Oh, it's your, th it's your like, 10-hour so song. Do you like the music? I like the music. I do. Hmm. Good. Why do you ask? This was the only music I had for so long. I found it in limbo. Trash, discarded by the universe. How does music end up in limbo? Is that normal? How can trash get to limbo? All forgotten things can find their way here. Even music, and the means to play it. Even now, I only listen at meaningful times, when I wish to remember the moment. There are more of those now, but not enough to outweigh the days I want to forget. Hunter, can we stay here for a time? Listen to the music? Of course. Let's just stay here until you, you need to go. Good. Uh, here, take this crystal ball. I'm not smiling. I am pleasantly surprised. You're smiling. Who brought you here? Could you tell me about the creature you mentioned? Something I hope you never have the misfortune to meet. I can't say no more. Okay. Why not? F no, don't, don't pry. It hears when you speak its name. I refuse to give it this satisfaction. What happened to it? An eviction of sorts. A permanent one? That is my hope. This room is familiar. Why does this look like your room in the Abbey? It doesn't. My room in the Abbey looks like this one. For years, this was the only place in Limbo where I was safe. Where I felt at home. Are you really a lost queen? The creature said many strange things about you. How much was true? None. All were lies to manipulate a stupid child. The creature brought me here to rule this place, but not as I do now. It desired a servant. Loyal, unthinking. A stupid child who believed its lies. I took great pleasure in disappointing it. Ready to go? I should get going. I will open a portal for you. Good night, Magic. See you, Hunter. You know what? It's good that she it's good that uh that, that she likes you. I should We are not besties yet, but we are getting there. Are we? Are we? Uh, that's nice to hear. Hey, Nico. You were gone for so long. Did you find magic? I did. I did. She is going to spend the night in limbo. Is she doing all right? Is she mad at me? We hung out. She is fine. We had a lot of fun. You did? We did. Yeah. We listened to music in limbo. It was all right. An achievement unlocked, I guess. At least her birthday ended on a high note. That's all that matters. I can't thank you enough for doing this. Don't know how this would have ended without you. Good night, Hunter. Good night, Nico. Good night, Nico. Uh. Balanced collar, rare collar, draw two Hunter cards. Wow. Okay. My kind of
kind of ruckus. No, don't don't say, don't don't be so happy. What we've literally caused a girl great pain. Hello, caretaker. Salutations. I remember when I used to go out on these missions myself. At least I can always rely on you to get the job done. Oh well. Oh well. Let's go to sleep, wake up, and uh. Oh yeah. You have not set anything on fire today, have you? Just the carpets. Just the carpets. Very good. Right. We sleep. And then tomorrow we'll see how this whole magic thing plays out. <laughs>